clock keeps ticking like a metronome And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my balls keep telling me to let me out Oh, just let me out That clock keeps ticking like a metronome And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my balls keep telling me to let me out Oh, just let me out That clock keeps ticking like a metronome And my thoughts keep telling me to get They're me back. home But my balls keep telling me to let me out Fuck all that shit we live along, bitches, broadcasting live from the heart of Europe. This is the most badass YouTube broadcast in all the no land, ladies and gentlemen. I am Tommy C. This is Shop the Point. Let's point men. Today are the original originals. Yeah. Jeff Huffman coming out from St. Louis and from Las Vegas. Home of the Las Vegas Knights. Future Stanley Cup champions. Real talk, the metaphor Messiah. How you doing, boys? No, I'm, I don't I'm, know. I'm, let's, let's not give him the cup yet. I mean, I think. I don't know. Every time I turn on the TV, Dave's oh, giving them the cup. They have the lock on the best Twitter. Right are, are they? They do have that. Are, are, look, real. Are they really like? Are, are people into it over there? Like, yeah, dude, it's crazy. It's crazy I right thought, now. I wouldn't have thought because, like I told you, you know, it's another. It's a whole game. It's a gambling sports. Yeah, they're not like they're us. really into this shit. Like, yeah, man. I think it's because they're winning, though. You know what I mean? Yeah, I really. That's what I. People love it. I really want. They, 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 they love don't women. have that one superstar. It's a bunch of players that nobody wanted, and it's everybody's just like, okay, well, well everybody said fuck you, us. So you don't think Flurry is a superstar? I wouldn't say superstar, but if you had to give a face to the team, it'd be Flurry. Yeah, I don't know. He's still fucking. He's been hurt the whole damn year. Yeah, I know. And then fucking All Subban. All the boys have been hurt the whole damn yeah, I know. year. It's crazy. Hey, you want to hear something? You want to hear something funny, Jeff? Um. Real talk, uh, he calls me about 20 minutes ago. He says, come on, let's go. We got 10 minutes. We got five minutes. I'm like, what are you talking about? I'm not even ready. He's like, we got to get going. I'm like, we got 20 was, minutes before showtime. I was baked. Dude. Yeah. Like, well, you're, was, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, but that's, is the sky blue? How many, bla how many, how many black guys show up on time for work when they're smoking weed? This guy's early. I, know, I, was, I was ready to go. Yeah. I was ready to go. Before I called Tommy, I called Dave. I was like, hey, Dave. <laughs> Dave's like, what do you want? Yeah, you know, yeah. Like, oh. <laughs> You're not Tommy. <laughs> I think she gave everybody weed if they're going to show up early. I'm okay, I'm okay with that. He's like, I'm sorry. I'm like, oh, no, there's there's no issue here at well, all. I'm hyped, Tommy. Let's go. I haven't been on the show in a while. I'm baked. Yeah. I, heard, I, just, heard, I just heard Jake Paul say, nigga, 500 times. <laughs> good, man. We're going to get into that. That's the other thing we're gonna we'll touch on Logan definitely going to Jake, uh, but first, um, I think what we do He's best be the funniest brothers I ever seen. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> don't play dead I don't guys. Know, I don't know. Funny is the right word for it. I think they're funny. stupid might be a better word for well, it. Well, you got to give Jake this like that. I don't know if you saw that rapper Jay Cyrus, right? He caught that video two years earlier. And he's just some rapper, some white rapper just happens to be sitting in the same place late at night in a bar. And he hears this white dude say, dropping the end bomb. Why he's rapping? That'd get my attention too. Thank yeah, you so mom. much. <laughs> Welcome to the fuckheads. That yeah. got my attention too. What else? Hey, look at this cat. Flips on the camera. Jake Paul takes one look at him. Keeps saying the N word. Doesn't it's care. Going. Doesn't care. I gotta be honest. I kind of felt that when he looked up at the camera, he said, "So I'm still gonna say this shit." Yeah, I don't yeah, care. Yeah, well, yeah, well, you you caught me. I might as well just keep going. Uh, I don't know. I, I just, I don't think those boys give a fuck. I Tommy, he was going in. If you listen to it, he was going in, bro. Like, yeah. Niggas don't want it. I was like, damn, <laughs> damn. <laughs> damn. No. Yeah, like he was getting people's pussies wet and, and, and damn. That's, uh, it, it was, it was crazy. Um, what we do best here on Shot from the Point is, um, Go over douchey beefs, and uh, have I got one for you guys today? Um, and the biggest douchebag, I think, uh, of all time. Well, maybe not of all time, but he's definitely vying for the title with Hampton Brandon. You know, the guy that got chased by black guys and hit by a car? Yeah, Remember him? yeah, yeah. Waffled by a car, yeah. It was great. I got money to make. Boop. <laughs> hey, one black dude was like, good. See, <laughs> I, see, I must be doing something right here because he's got a Yeti. Yeah, uh, yeah, I don't know what you're. No, I noticed that. No, he's not doing something right. He's just, he's too rich to care. He's also what about outside. this chair though. Am I doing right by that? Yeah, yeah. Did you get a sponsorship? What is with you in this chair? You better not have got a sponsorship behind my back. <laughs> no, I mean, cause no, there's no print on it. I wish I got a sponsorship. Yeah, you better tell it. me. 
It's like, hey, I'll pay you real cheap so you can go on Tommy's show. Look at my chair. Look at my chair. <laughs> oh, man. But, uh, yeah, that's what we got. All right, let's... Um, I, I, I have a headache, guys. Um, and I, I'm trying... I really tried to hide the You're heartache. Me, I, I was... I, yeah, I was I'm, like trying, trying, I'm trying to hide. The I last have, four days. Oh, I, I spent all day uh, chasing my kids in some, like... Park and uh, indoor park, and I'm my head hurts. That's all right. So I'm trying. I'm 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 riding through this shit. I'm doing the best I can. So let's watch these two goofballs. Well, I, f I feel great. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should uh, start smoking weed. You know, I don't know. Don't even talk about. This. Okay, I saw let's see. All right, I don't know what that. They're supposed to hash shit out or some dumb shit like that. I don't know. Oh, he's in a twitch dude. You were like that, yelling at security. You're trying to fight security. You put he's talking about the time when he got thrown out of uh, Twitch. <laughs> yeah, when he's like, do something in Twi TwitchCon. There's some guy, dude. Come he on. Let's, okay, whatever. Let's be real. What do you mean? Okay, don't whatever. put yourself so you go, in that. Why are you saying? Why are you speaking over me like you're? What, did because you're really wrong. You to speak? I'm trying to Am put I you, wrong? Okay. No, I'm telling you, Tell you're wrong. That. A fucking SJW walked in between me and my friend Freddy way too close. She bursted my personal space. I called her out on it on bursted stream. My personal space. Bursted my personal <laughs> space. <laughs> Yo, you bursted oh. my. Where is he from? Where is that guy from? Anybody know in the chat? He reminds me of this fucking... Reminds me of LA, somebody from LA. Bro. Yeah, well, he reminds me of this guy I knew, Donnie, when I was, uh, when I lived in. He was, like, the first white guy I ever met that tried to be black, you know? And, like, it was real <laughs> shocking. It was, it was a hard... Yeah, it was, was, a, this, it was, was an this back home in New Jersey? Yeah, but I was, like, 13, so I was just kind of, okay, like... Cause, well, so, see, because I was going to say somewhere northeast... He's from New York. Yeah, I knew he was close to me. That sounds yeah, about right. Yeah, he's Long Island. He's Long Island. Yeah, big fucking Long Island douchebag. I knew it was something. It reminded me of somebody back home. Mm. Big mouth. Seconds later, she accuses me of saying I was kicked out. I've been kicked out. I have to leave like ten times. Everyone's seen. She wait a minute. She accuses you of I've been kicked out. I've been kicked out. I've been kicked out like ten times. That's a hell of an accusation. How did you? I wouldn't have stood for that either, Brandon. She accuses you of being kicked out. This guy really is a fucking. I mean, he he's really is. I gotta think he's funny. That's what did. <laughs> he's <laughs> fucking funny, man. Fucking speed bump. He, he thinks he he's tough, bro. Yeah, I know. He never actually fights. He just uh, he kind of <laughs> does his thing all the time, where he gets really, really angry. He's he's that guy in school that never wanted to get fight. He's like, I'm crazy, man. I'm crazy. I'm crazy. Don't touch me. I'm crazy. I'm crazy. Hold me back. Just, hold me back. Hold me back. No, he doesn't do yeah, that. No, that's the hold me back bro. He's usually a jock. No. The, 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 the weird kid goes, I'm crazy. You don't know what I'll do. I'll come in with a chainsaw. I'll cut you all down. No, you just, you don't want to fight. This is what happens. King Street douche. That's, yeah, that's, that's about right, Alpha. In the video, dude, why do you do this? Why can't you just be real? We can't even have a real comp- Bro, for the, for the you not have- Bro, you're just I like- I framed that you're Twitch gone just Andy, bro. Touch me! <laughs> so he throws the thing at Paul. That's funny. Touch me, bro! Touch me, bro! Touch me! Touch you me! Need to go. Uh, touch me! I just got a, a subscriber on Twitch, uh, Silk Silver. Thank you so much. You to touch me, do something. You need to go. Touch me, do something. You need to fuck you up. Do something. I have shit to lose. Do something. I'm not gonna do, do something. something. I have shit to lose. I'm late for it, too. I have shit to lose. I have way more than you. I have way more than you. I have way more than you. Get the fuck out of here. You're fucking delusional as fuck, bro. Get delusional You're losing my interest because you're not fighting. He's got his hands all loose. He's got his fist all locked up. He's ready to go. Yeah, he he's angry. He's ready to go. Yeah. <laughs> he's going to punch Paul right in the nose. You Would be the hard. version of the Arthur Fist meme right there, then. <laughs> oh, Paw Patrol 2420 for Separate Chills. Real talking. Jeff, thank you so much. Welcome Yo. to the fuck. Hey. 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 Yeah, he's got his fist all clenched and shit. Like he's, he's, like, ready. he's ready, bro. Look at this motherfucker. He's ready. He's ready to go. He's ready to... Punch Paul in that big old nose of his. What's up? You want that? You want some meat, bro? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get out of here. You're fucking delusional, bro, and your fucking fan base needs to stop. How do you? Who does that? Who points to a fucking homeless guy and says, "Hey, you want something to eat?" <laughs> Another twenty-six <laughs> bucks. I'm so mean. I make medicine sick, Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> Fuckheads in rare form. He's like, hey, like, who gets it? I'll fucking kick your ass. Hey, bro, you hungry? Honestly, I got you, bro. <laughs> you that time. Well, I've never seen nothing in the hood like that go down. <laughs> I mean, we, we've, seen, we've seen people never. exploit kids for cancer, and we... Uh, yeah, we have well, seen well, that. So let's, so let's move on to homeless people. Oh, God, that's so funny. <laughs> 
So then you <laughs> we haven't done this. The box, bro. He turns around and says, "Hey, you want some money, bro? I've never hey, seen." <laughs> it's a fucking first. And where I'm from, Tommy the Bum would have been like, "You about to get your ass whooped." <laughs> you ain't gonna feed me. <laughs> well, well, see that already happened. Then he ran and got hit by a car. <laughs> <laughs> I got some money to make. Oh, God, that was the greatest thing ever. Okay. One of the greatest hey, videos in YouTube history. That's too funny. Though. All right, well, this shit gets better. You're about to lose your shit. Stop losing your fucking lies. Do something, weirdo. Watch out. Hit me. Hit me. Come on, buddy. I got Yo, you. Red Lowe's matter. Rod Trey's room breaks. Yo, these stupid ass yuppies. <laughs> Yo, look at this yuppie, though. They didn't even fight. Look at this, though. I just like the puppy. Don't even fight. The fucking homeless guy came in and think. Yo, yo, look at these yuppies, bro. Red Lives Matter, bro! <laughs> now, that guy was from California. Hold signs. Oh my god. <laughs> I gotta watch that shit again. He said they didn't even fight. <laughs> I, I gotta watch that shit again. That was so yeah, I got Yo, you Red food. Lows Matter. Rod Trey's room breaks. <laughs> Yo, these stupid ass yuppies. <laughs> Yo, look at this yuppie, though. They didn't even fight. <laughs> they didn't even fight. They fake ass. I got you a food, bro. I got your food. Don't fucking touch me, bro. Don't touch me. Touch me. Don't touch me, bro! I'm crazy! So I'm crazy! Oh, you don't know what I'm gonna do! I'm crazy! I'm crazy! Boogie, boogie, boogie! Oh. Boogie, boogie! Is his hands behind his back? Yeah, he's like, he got this, he's got a weird so thing fuck. where he sticks If I was the other his... guy with a swung on him. Right yeah. Hands... Oh, actually, actually, in that p position, headbutt. You fucking, you, you just hit that fucking top of your head and right in his nose. That'll fuck yeah, him up he... real quick. He'll come up swinging, but he'll hit the yeah, goddamn yeah, cigarette machine. Wait, you gotta do something. Do yeah. something. I would. I, I, somebody gets in your face like that, just put your forehead in their nose, man. It fucks you up. You don't know where you are. You Real quick, bop. You, up. you know, I don't know. But Paul's got something to lose. <laughs> Actually, he just broke up with that fine girlfriend that of his. That's fucking funny. The guy gets in the camera. <laughs> he's yeah, he's he's... yuppies. Tommy, let me translate that for, for my black friends. <laughs> <laughs> Real quick, what it. happened was when he was, you know, yelling at him, the guy in the camera basically said, "Look at these punk, these punk niggas. These niggas punk, they ain't finna do shit." You know, guys, just so you guys know, that's what happened. But, see, Google Translate won't give you that. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. This is fantastic. Oh man, man, this guy's like he, this, this guy loses an argument and then he just like freaks the fuck out. It's funny. You need to I'll go. fucking kill you. you I'll kill you. You need to go. You need to go. You need to go. You need to go. Clearly you have issues. Clearly you have issues. Clearly you have fucking problems. Welcome to my TV. Okay. All right, let's see what Paul has to say. Where does he, where does he come that back? That was definitely not good for my image right there as well, back. but he threw a cup in my face and he needed, he needed, it was time for him to go. He needed to go. Well, maybe you can get on that card with Joe Waller and KSI. <laughs> oh, man, that's too mm. funny. Call, you know, the skinny white boy fucking fight of the century. You know, <laughs> be great. They're both about the same height, probably around the same weight. You know, might be fair. Who do you got? Jesus Christ, dude. And that's why he's bad for my image, because he can't have a conversation without getting all fucking emotional. And that's why I don't talk to him. That's why you had him on, Paul. Come on. <laughs> you know, come on. He, he's crazy. He got hit by yeah. a car. That's why he's crazy. He's yeah. fucking crazy. He's good for your image. That was great. To me, if you're a live streamer, those are the moments you live for. <laughs> that's... <laughs> it, it, it just doesn't fucking get much yuppies. better than that. You fucking yuppies. You fucking yuppies. That guy's a legend. Yeah, he's fucking funny. That's funny. Could have done a whole show yeah. on him. Because he's <laughs> emotional. He's emotional. And uh, like, I'm not going to fight somebody on a sidewalk, dude. Like, like, <laughs> like, I have fucking sponsors and shit, dude. Like, that's, that's not who I am, you know what I mean? Like, thank you, dude. So, like, okay, like, I have a lot to lose. He has nothing to fucking lose. There's the difference there, so... <laughs> that was autistic as fuck. Um, okay, dude, whatever. Look at his chat. Okay. Well, that was interesting <laughs> to say the fucking least, dude.
<laughs> yeah, that's fucking great. Oh, that was so funny. I, can I watch that guy one more time? I want to watch that man. <laughs> I gotta you watch him. I love how Ham. The, I love how Hampton grabs this fucking dude. Come on, I'll get you something to eat. Yup, you know. Okay. They didn't even fight. Okay. They didn't even fight. They faked <laughs> it. Come on, come on. Come on. I got some food, bro. <laughs> you want some food, bro? I'm in the you middle of the fight. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen anything like that, bro. Oh my God. In the middle of a fight, just, hey, bro, you want some food? <laughs> oh, shit. God damn, where are your brains, boy? Yeah, you got that right. <laughs> I'm gay. All right, fuck, enough of that. Enough of that. Could you imagine what his friend said, though, Tommy? If being one of his friends watching him get ready to fight, if he said that, I was like, what? bro, what? <laughs> what is wrong with you? They're probably reevaluating the friendship. The funny thing is he was telling him he was kind of like crazy because the way he acted at TwitchCon. And then what he's, oh, that's not true. And then he acted just like he did on TwitchCon. <laughs> he was, he's going to fight that black security guard. He's running away. Yep. He's running away from black people. I got money to make. <laughs> I don't have time for you. I got money to make, man. And those guys, those black dudes he was messing with, they weren't, none of them had Twitch channels. You know what I'm saying? No, they, you know. No, they did not. <laughs> they, they, they didn't have, uh, I don't think uh, they had the same mindset as, uh, none of them had a clothing line. You know what I mean? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. So he's from New York. Oh, what a shock. Uh, Brandon, the new homeless guy, entertains ice cream. So it's like, look, he's got it. Like, Brandon's moving up in the world, though. Kelly, he asked that. You want to grab something to eat? <laughs> <laughs> in the middle of a fight. Hey, bro, you want something to eat? <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, I got you. I got you. <laughs> Just got a $50 donation. We're going out to eat. <laughs> what, what 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 happened to this planet we're in, man? Like, like this is, that's crazy. the world has really changed a lot with this fucking live streaming shit. That would have I mean, changed my life for the better. <laughs> what happened? Well, if you're too much of an idiot to be good in anything else, just film just yourself look, being an idiot. Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> Works for me. Yeah, but you, yeah, but you live in a foreign country. So what does that have to do with anything? <laughs> well, you have a little bit. You I'm an international an idiot. Is that what you're saying? I mean, what the fuck, Jeff? <laughs> no, you have a little bit of an excuse. I have no excuse. I, 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 I am. Well, here's the best part. I don't even care. <laughs> you know. <laughs> All right, I was just gonna give you the rundown. I'm talking about Jake Paul dropping the n bomb, uh, which is. Nicole? It's I'd run the down. TMZ thing. I'd run the TMZ, but they're running around claiming cats, right? And the best part, this this rapper Jay Cyrus, he's got about forty k. Maybe he's got more if I'm wrong. On uh, YouTube, uh, he's an independent uh, rapper, independent artist, does some comedy skits. He claims this is the fucking crazy part, right? And and neither they reported it, but I'm thinking there's something else to it. And remember what I said, boys and girls, it starts here. Yep. Here, here's the thing. Assuming Cyrus is telling the truth, and assume, assuming somebody didn't lift that shit from his phone, here's the story. They were in that pub. Some white boy gets up and starts dropping the end bomb on a freestyle rap, which would have got my attention too. <laughs> he was like, "Look at this guy. This is funny." <laughs> niggas don't want it. <laughs> <laughs> this 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 white blonde haired blue eyed boy. Is from Ohio. <laughs> like, yeah. I mean, Brandon Hampton's from fucking Long Island. He don't even talk like that. <laughs> Tommy, that would scare me. If I, I'm going to be honest. If I saw Jake Paul and he told me y'all niggas don't want it, I was like, <laughs> maybe you're right, bro. I, I don't. He might, I, you, know, you know why? I don't blame you. Because he might know something you don't. He might you know? Know. <laughs> yeah, I, the balls of that I guy. I don't want to listen to Sometimes it. when people you're speak right. like they have balls, that they, they means they know something. They yeah, have they something. Fuck <laughs> that. You know, it's like those old cowboy movies, like when the cowboys used to go to like the, the with these killer Indian tribes and they would act all crazy and shit and the mm. Indians wouldn't kill them because they're like, man, the ghost got a hold of them or some shit. It's a scene like that in Young Guns. Oh, That's what yeah. it is. You walk up to a black dude and start saying the N-word. It's like, you know, the guy's obviously out of his mind. He's sick. Leave him alone. You don't want to catch it. Wow. You know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Leave him alone. Get away. <laughs> Zombie apocalypse. <laughs> you know? <laughs> so the thing that gets me, so this this white rapper jumps up and, and he puts puts him right on camera. Jake looks like, what the fuck are you looking at? And keeps on dropping the N-bomb. All right? Here's the spooky part. He claims, if this is true, and this is before Jake was mega famous, all right? He claims. So Jake was a little famous back then because he had Bizarre Vark. It was 2015. Nickelodeon's better. Nickel, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but he says he only showed it to six people, tops. Damn. And he didn't know who he was. It was more like, look at this white boy, right? Look at this white boy saying the N-word. Not look at Jake Paul. Look at this white boy. At least that's the impression he gave me. How the fuck did TMZ get that video? That's crazy. And then they have the like bulls. Tommy. And here's the other thing. I want, I want you guys to think about this. And I mentioned this slightly on Get to the Point. There was a situation in 2012 where the mirror, which is a, a tabloid, sort of like TMZ, and they're connected to another a bunch of tabloids. They were actually tapping people's phone, paying off cops. They tapped the damn prince's phone, checking their DMs, checking their messages. That's and crazy. stuff like that. These guys at TMZ, you got the balls. Anybody covers this shit gets claimed. Nobody's asking the question here. How the fuck? Except for Jay Cyrus. He was like, hey, did you, is there something wrong with my phone? Did somebody hack my phone? You know, Jay, I think TMZ probably hacked your phone. Because yeah, there is precedent. It would sound like a crazy fucking conspiracy theory. But there is precedent. Major news organizations in the UK did this. People went to jail. Where did this come from? Now, I mean, maybe somebody got into his phone. Maybe they passed it around. It might be all a simple explanation. <clears throat> but there is precedent for tabloids breaking into prominent people's phones. Now, the argument was, well, he's not prominent. He's a small-time rapper. Yeah. But you don't know how far this could stretch. You don't know, yeah. I'm wondering, where did they... No one even... Nobody is... Like, did they tap his phone? How the fuck did they know? I mean, it, like, how would they even know and to when, tap when his phone? When was this from, like, for two years ago? 2000, 2015. That's crazy, man. Yeah. He claimed... Now, he could be wrong. Maybe somebody saw it and snatched it up real quick. But what are the odds? It was on what his did, camera roll. It was on his camera roll. Is there any way to get to that remotely? I mean, I'm not a tech expert by any means. Anybody, anybody in the chats, anybody in the chats got theories that wants to make hey, calls? If he's had a phone since well, 2015. That's, that's impressive. Shit, yeah. That's impressive. Yeah. Well, camera roll isn't that in the cloud? Could you could if you spec up stuff to the, to the cloud? Then really? So yeah. That Where the be... fuck did they get that shit? And then they had the balls to claim it. It ain't even theirs. That's that's, usually, that's, that's, that's that's without that's a doubt. How, how, that's usually how a lot of photos get leaked. It goes to the fucking cloud. I mean, unless this guy's trolling everybody and he sold the fucking thing. Because all Jay Cyrus was wor worried about is like, how come I'm not getting paid? Well, you, I, I think you got a bigger problem than that. How yeah. did they get it? Um, everybody that's um, asked them the question, they haven't answered. I mean, could have been. Could it have did, been? I was looking at it like, man, did somebody else take it? That's and possible. You didn't know or some shit. That's crazy. It's he insane, said he right? said he texted like six people, well, five or six people. Sure. Maybe one of them. Could, maybe one of them could have yeah. sold it off. Oh, maybe, yeah. That's crazy though. I don't know, man. That's that's weird. That is fucking strange. One of those six that's people. Well, see, he said showed sent. If he sent it, that's uh, no running right. It's right. If he sent it, see, he said showed. So I don't know what he meant by showed. If he meant showed, like he sent it to somebody. Look at this white guy He's saying the n word over and over again. Balls of this guy. Jesus, I'm a professional white rapper. I can't get away with that shit. Look at this. Who's that uh, guy that is? Well, I mean, the way to, the way today or today runs, I would be yeah, four to five people. That he, it, that he sent, it's that he it's, sent it, it. it's kind of solved if he sent it. Now I took it as like, look at this, like like by hand, not not by sent it. But that is kind of solved if that be the case. If you want to show something to a couple different people, are you going to actually physically show it to them, or are you going to send them a link? The UK mirror was not done hacking voicemails. Not from, are you sure about that? Mm. That might be as simple as it. That might be simple right there. But Jesus Christ! Now I may have mis I, I may have misunderstood. Six people means twenty seven probably. That's another. That's a good point too. The poke patrol. The poke patrol. Two bucks. Jake Paul leaked it himself to get the heat off of Logan Paul. A real bro. 
<laughs> oh, you're that dead body. Hey, bro, That's I got true. you. I got you. I, oh, I said the oh, end. Said the end one at a bar, like I'm a rapper or something. I gotta, I gotta really. Maybe he dropped it himself, man. You never know. Wonder if Gucci Mane would have. Uh, yeah, I wonder if Gucci. <laughs> how does Gucci Mane feel? That's the most concerning part, Tommy. Yes. His, Jake Paul was saying, "Nigga, two years ago." <laughs> God damn. <laughs> I think he says it every day, bro. Really, yeah, I think really he cool says guy. it People every day, bro. Worried about PewDiePie. I don't He's think that cat. I look the way they talk about other people, the way they treated the Martinez pr twins. Look, I'm all for fucking. <laughs> you were about to say the Martinez pricks, weren't you? <laughs> no, most me too. I don't know. Like maybe those Martinez twins. The way they kind of talk. Like, look, I'm all for fucking stereotype jokes. I hate when people just like when you make cracks about ethnicities it automatically means you hate ethnicities you hate other people besides yourself i gotta be honest with you there is mounting evidence that these guys are fucking they think that people that aren't like them are fucked up you know at very least maybe not inhuman but definitely fucking uh uh fucked up so i uh, i may have misunderstood the whole fucking thing I don't know. I mean, I mean, I'm not really mad at him for saying it. The way he was, especially the way he was saying it. I mean, he was doing it in a song. I thought yeah. I was going to give him the benefit of the doubt because I thought he was repeating song lyrics. You know, I don't know if you can blame somebody for repeating song lyrics. Well, you can't. Yeah, I mean, it's in there. If I if I rap the word nigga, and Jeff yeah, wants yeah. to copy me, then go ahead, Jeff. It yeah, might you, sound weird, but you should see me rapping when I'm when when nobody's around. Put the music I already on. Sound weird <laughs> enough. I don't need to. I scream yeah. the end bomb. <laughs> Doesn't count though. You know, TMZ <laughs> drops money. Who would rather drop money right now? The poor the Paul brother. Well, that's funny. Well, I hope that guy gets paid. But I guess if he shared it, it's no yeah. one him. I don't even know. But I think that I think we've solved the mystery. Thank I gotta God be I honest, Tommy. That ain't he. Can, he can say nigga all he wants. That's not what Logan. What Logan was on was something really real weird, man. I got a guy contact me and tell Logan me how to was handle. on some weird shit, bro. Yeah, Logan's on some. Yeah, nah, I think it's simple. He wanted to find a body. I, I'm I'm going along with Ace Trainer Liam on this. I but think Tommy, he's, that's weird, bro. Do you not understand? Like, what do you mean he wanted to find a body? He wanted to find a body. It's just that simple. I don't want to go out and find a body, Tommy. That's These motherfuckers, about. all they think about is money and views. That's all they think about, man. There's no man. That's over the line. There's none of that. There's none of that. You can't do something else, bro. Go do something. You know what I mean? You can't. I don't Guess know. Not. Man, when, I, <laughs> when, I, when I first signed my deal in, in Vegas, the first thing I didn't think about was I gotta go to Japan right now and, and get a and sit I'm right next to a dress up as a body. fucking oh, Pikachu and throw a Pokeball pillow at a fucking car. That's what I'm gonna do. I didn't find that at all offensive. That didn't seem any worse than some of the oh, shit no, they're blowing out of proportion. I found it retarded. But. You know, some of the shit I found, like, they're digging up old tweets. Like, in 2012, he's like, I met a nice Asian boy. His name is Isaac. And he's got a picture of himself hold, holding a nice Asian boy, right? And then he's, like, waving at the camera. And they're like, racist! I'm like, I, I don't know about that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's a little... I don't know about black... Di I mean, even if, to be honest with you, maybe he picked up, look at this cute black kid! His name's Jim! <laughs> That's nothing racist about it either, you know? That's kind of weird. But the other, some of the other stuff, like, you know what pissed me off about the whole video? Him leaving the that? fish on somebody's car. That pissed me off. You left a fish on my car and just walked yeah. away? I, I, I think you would have something to answer for. That pissed me off more than anything. <laughs> you wouldn't say, hey, bro, you want to get something to eat? Yeah. <laughs> no, no. Come on, I'll whip your ass, and I'll get the homeless guy down to shoot something to eat. <laughs> Have him cook the fish. <laughs> the Poke Patrol. The Poke Patrol. Gallery of Suicide. The faggotry is strong in 2018 already. Yes. I yes. kind of agree, yes, man. I got to be honest. Good. That's money in a bank for good old Tommy C. I hope these guys act like bigger assholes all the time. And One of me. his friends should have been there and said, Logan, don't do this shit, man. That's stupid. Tommy, if you ever did some shit like that, bro, I'm calling you the next day. I, I, I have plenty yes, of people. Yes. My wife would have told see, me. I could, see, I could see Tommy doing that. He's dressed up as Pikachu before. Well, no, I'm saying Tommy's going out over to a dead, dead body. And, shit and, 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 and blogs it. I'm calling you the very next day. What, I'm, what the Never fuck is wrong with you, Tommy? Shit. It felt you know horrible. It's crazy. You know what the other thing, too, is I didn't actually watch the uh, the corpse the first time around. Uh, it's just cause that shit disgusts me, you know, but, uh, yes. me and, you know, for educational reasons and shit, me and Xanta were looking at it privately 
And because uh, I was wondering, is wouldn't it be funny if this this thing was a fake? You know, and now he's got to take, he's getting all this shit for it being fake. And now he can't even say it's fake because it makes it even worse, right? <laughs> so I was looking at the uh, the close-up shots and the video and some still photos. Man, that man, first of all, he must have killed himself. It couldn't have been more than a couple hours, right? He seems to be in some sign of uniform. His fists are purple. And uh, we looked it up. That's consistent with with uh, strangulation. Thanks, Cold Ice. Welcome to Fuck It. And you're gay. <laughs> Don't unsub now. But, um, yeah. And I'm thinking it's, it's, this, is, this is probably more than likely a real body. And he just was that fucking cold. He That's got up in the crazy, morning. Man. He acted and like a jerk. Like, give me the freshest one. Yeah, he I mean, got a fresh one, too. That's fucked up, man. That's weird, man. Yeah, it's fucked up. And by the that's way, weird. Vice did a video, um, the news organization, five years ago. I watched it, and, and they went in there. But it was a documentary about the place, and they found a corpse, right? They found the skeletal remains of a hanging victim, a victim, if you want to call it that. And uh, it was tastefully done. People going in, they're going, it's, it's a newsworthy story. People go in there and kill themselves. They have signs all over the place begging you not to kill yourself. That's right? crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They have signs in this place. They say, please don't do this. Your life's a gift. Think your parents, think your kids, think yourself. They can't stop people. They can't stop people from people just lining up to kill themselves in that place. It's kind of like their uh, Golden Gate Bridge. Yeah, yeah. It's like their Golden Gate, but it's like 10 times worse, if you can yeah. believe that. You know, people jumping off yeah, it's the... Worse, it's worse anyway you do I that. think people jump off the Golden Gate Bridge like once a week or some shit like that, right? Like, uh, my wife yeah, is doing... Yeah. The... You don't see motherfuckers posing next to him. Yeah, I know. You know, you don't. You just you call the police. The fuck, motherfucker man, jumped funny. off the bridge. You call the police. Well, there was a movie called The Bridge, and it was talking about the problem in suicide. It came out about 10 years ago. It's actually free here on YouTube, right? You can watch people jump off the fucking bridge. So, so even one guy jumps off, he survives. But I'm like, tell me, I see all the outrage and people are pissed about it. But nobody, nobody's, we need to maybe get some this man some help. No. Like maybe Logan has a problem we don't know about. Yeah. I mean, Everybody's mad yeah. at him. Young, he's young got guy, tons, tons of money right yeah, away. Yeah, he's got a problem. It's called green. It's all he sees. It's all he sees. It's all it's about, man. It's real simple, man. You got like, we're, somebody's telling me, um, I couldn't remember the name. But it was the Stanford experiment. That's what's going on. Everybody's in this mindset of everything's okay for money. Well, you'll do some fucked up shit. It's that simple. There's, there's, there's nothing there. You're right. You know, you get that mindset, and that's why nobody around him said, uh, even the, uh, what, what, what was it? The um, the editor said, you know, we have been so hot for so long. We didn't even think that something fucked up would happen. We just didn't have it a mindset. 20 bucks, Patches Odalan. I had oh, a black person on the next one. Patches Odalan. Oh, Hula. Oh, I got it. Hula. You've, uh, never yeah. seen you've never seen Dodgeball? Dodgeball. Patches. No, I never saw Dodgeball, actually. Oh. It's funny. Patches. Yeah, that's Patches. a good movie. Patches of Hula Hand. Thank you so much, Patches. You're very generous. If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. What else I got? I got anything else? Joe Weller and KSI. Who are you going for? Oh, when is that happening? Like, like, like next month, like the third. Next, uh, Saturday. I don't know, Tommy. Like, I saw a picture of them like standing face to face. And I, the, I thought what that guy jumped in the camera and thought, I was like, these niggas ain't finna fight each other. I yeah. thought it was like a... No, no, they're fighting. It's, it's, it's a sanctioned no, I fight. No, they're fighting each other. I saw it. They're it's going to be the finger poke of doom. Yeah. I don't know, man. Yeah, but it might be funny. If it's really bad, it could be funny. You know what I mean? That's I'm rooting for KSI. Funny. I'm taking KSI, and here's why. All right? You tell me why. Most people are pulling for Joe Weller because, you know, KSI is kind of the top dog, and popularity-wise, he's the underdog, all right? I don't know. If, I don't know who's going to win. Be perfectly honest with you. I have no idea. No clue. Okay. But here's the thing. I want KSI, because he's like the bad guy going to this, to get knocked. I want him to knock that guy out. And I'll tell you why I want him to knock him out. What are you not knocking on my door for? <laughs> you know you ain't supposed to do this now. What's the matter with you? You saw my Hindi. You can't just come in here. What's the matter with you, girl? Say hello to Real Talk. She's taking over. What? I'm not here. That's cool. That's a first. What happened? She just walked in like she owned the goddamn place. <laughs> she's taking after. Oh. Uh, she's taking after Dave's daughter. Well, that ain't gonna fly here. 
She just came in. Where's my hand? Where's my phone? Like we, they call her handy. But where's my phone? Like I'm in charge of it. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> you're gonna see. It's begin. It's beginning. Jesus, got stream sniped. That's exactly it. <laughs> oh my God. The hell? You know damn well between nine and ten. That's it. They get a lock for that fucking door. Tommy's my wife doesn't Tommy's even. My wife don't even do that shit. <laughs> yeah, I have my like yeah exactly. Huffing up. Dave does this shit in his living room. I have my own fucking like studio. For fuck's sake, That's this funny. is my room. Maybe she feel like she running, Tommy. Yeah. I, I'm shocked. I wonder who she's going for, Joe Weller or KSI. <laughs> Well, I want, um, I want KSI to win, and here's why: because it really, when when KSI made that crack about him being depressed, I'm so sick of motherfuckers talking about depression and 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 saying you can't make fun of it and stuff. So that on that alone, I probably would have pulled for Weller, well, because he's the white guy, but just because he's a bitch, he's like <laughs> you can't talk about depression. I hope KSI knocks his teeth out, and I'm looking forward to it. So I'm rooting for KSI. That's well, right. They both swing me. like in some video game shit. They swing and they both fall out and shit. That'd be great. <laughs> That'd be Is it just gonna look like out. a big uh, button mashing competition? You know what we should do? We can't rebroadcast it or like retransmit or anything like that. But we could watch <laughs> the fight. And if there's like, I could take the a soundboard from Mike Tyson's punch out. If somebody gets uh, knocked out, <laughs> 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 no, sure. no, 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 no. Yeah, we can. Yeah, we can. Did you ever see the video of that guy? Uh -huh. uh, Broadcasting a UFC pay per view. Yeah, what? What yeah. video? That's illegal well, no. though. Retransmission yeah, is illegal. Yeah, I know. But he put in the title that he's playing UFC two, and he's sitting there watching the fight, acting like he's playing with the controller visible in his hand. Oh really? Yes. Oh, it's that's funny. But you can't thing. like commentating is considered a, a a retransmission too. I might do no, it though. No, he was acting like he was playing the game. He's acting like he's playing. The game. It was and it was great. Let me see if I can find that. Yeah, I'll have to check that out. All right, everybody's put, pulling for Joe Wah. Uh, KSI is a fake black guy, <laughs> Uncle Tom. Double, double KO. That's what I'm rooting for. <laughs> Just so knock each other out. Yep. <laughs> like, like, Joe Weller comes up with a left hook and, and goes, goes a right, right hook, and they both hit each other in the chin at the same time. Yeah, here it is. I got it. <laughs> I'm putting, it, I'm, putting it in, I'm putting it in the Skype chat. KSI grew up in the hood of Wellington Garden, one of the lowest crime rate in rich areas of the UK at a private school he went to. Tommy, there you go. Check the Skype chat. It's 22 seconds long. Uh, I'll have to see this. Hold on. Let me, let me see this. What do we have here in the Skype chat? Uh, I don't want to fucking... Oh, God, that's so funny. I can't play because I'll get tagged by UFC. But... Oh my god, I wish I could play this shit. No, it's mm -hmm. it, it this is the funniest shit ever. It's a black kid <laughs> watching the fucking fight, streaming it, and he's got like, you know, he's got his gamer headset on, his fucking joystick, and he's acting like he's playing the motherfucker. <laughs> that might be the funniest shit I've seen all day. That might have been better this funnier than the homeless man. <laughs> oh, that's funny. It's just like the, I swear to God, look, look I swear to god. I'd look at the camera. He's like this. <laughs> the fight's in the back. <laughs> like he's playing the UFC. <laughs> I want to interview that guy. I think he got away with it, too. Did he good for him? He's a god, according ben, to the ben, comments. Ben I'm putting ben this Master play. Said he got away with it. The fuckheads have to see what I'm talking about. This might be the funniest shit I've ever seen. I'm putting that in the link. It's so blatantly, it's just so blatantly, it's just fucking funny. No. <laughs> he's, just he's just sitting there going back and forth. He's got his joystick. There we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, Jesus, man. That's oh, so yo, speaking of the UK, bro. Yes. I'll, I'll be there soon. Four bucks. So, you know, be there. Where you going? Mate. May 14th, dude, I got the date. May 14th, I'll be in the UK. Got a show down there. I don't have all the details, but we just signed the deal. We're going to work it out. May and May, I'll be there May 14th, bro. I'll be all, all in the UK. I'm thinking 15. about not going to VidCon now, so I might go by. I might just go with you. Dude, you got to come out, bro. I'm getting, I'm getting Yeah, I'm thinking about not going to VidCon now. I just like, ugh, I don't know what I want to do. I don't want to spend a lot of money. 
I don't want to fucking make that. Fl that flight is miserable. Is it? Oh, God. Think how long it took you to get here. Now I got to go yeah, from here to L.A. Thank you so much, Johnny. Mick. Yeah, what, 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 what is it from, like, the East Coast to L.A.? What is it, like, five hours? Yeah. So uh, it's, it's going to be it's probably a 12-hour flight. Rough. It's like a 12-hour like flight. Hours. Fuck yeah. that. Well, you basically, long how, long. how long was the flight to Frankfurt? For Fucking you? 11, 12. Fuck that. Maybe I just go to London. It's easy. Yeah, I'll be there. I'll be there in May. So you guys just come check me out. We have a good time and shit like that, bro. We're gonna take some calls before we end this uh, stream. Oh, Salute. Oh, Turn my stream off. Um, what's up, man? What do you want? What's what's the, what the dealio? Um, about the KSR situation. Do you think that he's gonna actually win the fight? Really? I don't know. What the, none, none of those two are professional athletes. What the fuck? Double KO, bro. Yeah. We're just, uh, have, have uh, do we do we have any uh, training footage for either of them? I just want something memorable to happen. Uh, no, there's no training footage. Yet, no. So okay. KSI looks like he lost some weight. Yeah, apparently, uh, what's it called? Joe Willis is getting trained by a former boxer, apparently. Yeah, that's all I know. No. You know that's, that's an advantage. And I, I, I just hope something weird happens so we can all um, talk about it and laugh. Me too. <laughs> I, I, I think it, it may come down to who can mash the button faster. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they should put that black kid at ringside with his joint with his fucking yeah. controller. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I want. Right. Hey, can, you, can you send that footage over to the uh, what's it called the uh, you know the Discord? Everyone can watch it and laugh about yeah, it. Yeah, I put it in there right now. It's fucking funny as shit. I got you. I got put you. The I already got it. I'm already. I already Thanks, got. It. Thanks for the call. You want to call? Join the Discord. Go to waiting. Call. Go in the queue. Um, dot dot dot. You're on the air. Oh boy. Yo yo yo. You know what it is, nigga. It's in that lore, nigga. It's what. <laughs> Jake yeah. Paul has joined us, everybody. Yeah, Jake Paul. You know what it is. It's Jake Paul. Hey, Jake, where do you get off saying the N word? You're you're a white man. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, of course I'm white. Of course I'm white. You, you what assumptions? Hey, you you know assumptions make an ass out of you and me. Yeah. You know now I, mean? I know you're white. You proved it. I'm sorry. You <laughs> fucking use that goddamn fucking thing. Hey, I'm mixed, nigga. Is what it is. <laughs> <laughs> hey, is what it is. Right. Yeah. But, I just, uh, I, I didn't have much to say. I just wanted to say, uh, shout out to Real Talk, nigga. Keep doing your <laughs> yeah, rap shit. You, you putting out some bars, my nigga. All right, man. Thanks, thanks for call. Shout out to Real Talk. Use yeah, information yeah, below. Nigga, we be back, gang. One fifty G and LR. Hit me up, Dashy one fifty on Twitter. You know what it is. All right. Get out. <laughs> <laughs> Greatest call ever. <laughs> really, you're gonna give greatest call ever to that? Crazy. He did. He went from being a white guy to a black guy. You know when you assume yeah. you make. Yo, 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 yo! What up, my nigga? What's going on? You know when you assume you make an hey. ass out of you and me. You know. Hey, he didn't do too bad, did he? No, he did. He did a good job. <laughs> that was that was the greatest. Thanks for the call. I thought, I thought Will Smith accomplished that a long time ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> good job. <laughs> Raging, uh, yeah. Raging Max, you're on the air. Who's gonna win the fight? I know you're. This this guy's my fighter, by the way. All right, Joe, um, KSI is not getting past the second round. Look How do you up know? Anthony Joshua. How do you Look know? Up Anthony Joshua. He's training Joe Weller. Oh really? So he's so the yeah. guy who's training Joe Weller's for real deal, Holyfield. Yeah, he's, yeah. Twenty wins by knockout. Twenty, uh, 20 wins. Uh, yeah, uh, 20 but does not mean he's a good trainer? There's a lot of good hockey players that made horrible coaches. Wayne Gretzky was one of the worst, worst coaches, coaches in fucking history. <laughs> and <laughs> one of the best Joe players ever lived. Before this KSI fight, too. So. Oh, he did. Yeah, he did. I hope. I hope that. I hope he knocks the pills out of his hands. I hate people saying you can't make fun of this. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I hope, I hope, I hope the black guy advantage, because, you know, it just seems that white guys just can't beat black guys in a fight for some reason. And I hope it's like Joe Weller's train, he's over there, and then just like, he hit, and then fucking KSI hits him, and just like, he gets the, you know, that, that white guy jaw, just, unk, um, over. That's what I think. I'm rooting for KSI. Yes. Joe Weller has been like posting pictures of him getting hurt in practice, and like everyone's making fun of him. <laughs> I know you're paying attention to this, Max. That's why I put yeah. you on. Yeah. Max is uh, Max is my fighter. He's, you're gonna fight with one of my uh, some of my gear on, right? Yeah, my tank top, right? Yeah. Yeah, you got tank top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it should be in April. It should be like the end of April. Like that's what I'm mean, like, um negotiating a contract I, and shit. I wish we could live stream that shit. 
I can, I'll periscope it. I'll have my friend periscope it. I would. I'd, I'd watch if we could pull something off. I'll watch that. Yeah. I'll watch yeah. it. That's dope. Why don't you yeah, like? I'll... Why don't you call yourself like? Can you give yourself a crazy name like the Point Man or some shit like that? Um, <laughs> that my coaches call me Raging, so that's why. Raging. Yeah, Raging. Yeah. Raging. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I hope you win, because I won't talk to you no more if you don't. I won't. Yeah. <laughs> he's going to disown you. I was right, thinking man. that too, Tommy. Like, man, I hope he wins. Cause... Nah, this guy, this guy buys all my gear and stuff. No way. You're a friend for life. I'll win. Actually, it might be funny if you lose all the time. It might go better along with the show. <laughs> you could be like Tony Danza in Taxi, you know? <laughs> Got another fight? I don't care. Go, go. Do your best, and uh, don't fucking do it the fucking... Don't get hurt, man. Do what the what your trainers tell you to I do. I got hurt in my last fight. Like I got cut open. Remember? I sent you the pick. Yeah, but getting cut open is one thing. I'm talking about doing something stupid like to your diet or your fucking, you know. Bro, Tommy's being nice right now. I'm going to tell you, don't lose with our gear on. Don't lose with our gear on. Um, don't fucking lose, bro. With our gear on. <laughs> Yeah. Actually, if you think you're gonna lose a fight. I've never been finished. I've never been. I've never been finished. You've never been. You've okay, never been knocked shit. out. Yeah. yeah. I've been knocked down a few times, but I've never been finished. You never been finished off. All right. Yeah. All right. Nice. nice. Shit happens. <laughs> Don't worry about it. We yeah. were just kidding you. Yeah. Raging Max, no, everybody. I'm not kidding. Don't you can't put it on an SFP <laughs> shirt and lose. <laughs> the fuck? All right, Max. Stop telling him that. We'll we'll talk about it, see if we get down Periscope. I might stream the shit. What the fuck? We get the Periscope yeah. stream on here. I'll put it up. And then uh, we'll critique you and act like we know what the fuck we're talking about. You know what I mean? Right. Okay. <laughs> you know? I, I'll try and come, come up with a different nickname, though, because, you know. Nah, Raging if you Max. want Raging Max, you need Raging Max. Yeah. I don't know why, like, an Asian kid's got fucking Raging Max. You sound like you're Irish. That would be funny, because you look Asian. Oh, like my, gra my grandma's Irish. Irish so. Go with some Irish, uh, a, a green, uh, white, and orange pants like you're fucking Conor McGregor. That'll throw everybody for a fucking loop. Uh, I will. I will. <laughs> I like that, Raging right. Max. He sounds like a crazy white boy. I like that. No, he's not. He's a crazy Asian kid. I'm half oh, half Asian. Oh, that's even, that, that's crazy. scarier. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All, right. Scary, All right. All right, All there, right. Kung Fu Lu. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> <laughs> nah, Raging Max. He's a man. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> right. I always wanted to say that on a live show because, like, uh, <laughs> I've been saying that shit for years in front of my kids, and they think it's funny. <laughs> they think That's, that shit's funny. That is. <laughs> I can't believe my daughter just walked in here like she owned the fucking place. What the Damn, fuck? Damn, you're still on that. Uh, she knows better. She knows this is... I don't blame him because it start. That's how it starts, Jeff. Next she thing knows, knows should be better. Him. That's what I was saying. That's Next thing saying, should be kicking his ass saying, Daddy, fix me a sandwich. <laughs> You gotta stop while it's ahead. Doc Holiday. Wait, is that like, Joe Cronin? Yeah. Doc Holiday? That's that goes way back. All right, uh, the ghostly boogie here on the air. Hey, hey, hey. Hey. Can you hear me? Yes. What's up, nigga? Uh, okay, so I got two questions. Do I have time to ask both? I maybe. It depends on how good the first one is. <laughs> Go ahead. All right, I'll I'll make I'll make, I'll, I'll make it special then. All right, so first question uh -huh. for someone like Keem Sar, someone like Logan Paul, someone like Jake Paul, or even Fousey Tube, who yeah. doesn't have any fans in his quarter, yeah. is redemption even possible for someone like that? Someone who's so yeah, look Keem Star, everybody despised. thinks he's look, look at fucking Keem Star. Everybody loves him now. I think he's yeah. Great just guy. get Jake, Jake and Logan just need to hook up with Tommy. Yeah. <laughs> well. Yeah. That and those were a bad example. Fire. I mean, someone who's who doesn't have anyone in their corner. Someone like Fuji Tube or someone like uh. Yeah, I'll I tell you, the judge is always on, possible but. unless you're like like Lion Make or some shit because you just got to do something that makes the people like, you know, kind of rebrand yourself and like, wait a minute, isn't that the guy that did that? Yeah, but that was years ago. Okay, this is great. So uh -huh. redemption's always possible unless you killed somebody. <laughs> like I don't think OJ is uh, gonna be redeemed. <laughs> I don't think Probably that's going to happen. You know, Charles Manson never got around. And he kind of went to his oh. grave being a bad guy. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah. I don't think well, that's fair. I think Zaptai, if you want to go YouTube route, I don't think there's much you can do for him. Um, uh, yeah, that's kind of fucked. Uh, the way I always viewed it was is, is if someone commits an act that they can't go back on, like Lion Maker, for example, he. Yeah. 
you know, he did that. And if you're just an asshole, not really a if whole you're lot just a, back from that. if you're just a backstabbing prick asshole, yes, you can go back, right? But if it's if it's right. criminal, if it's sexual deviance, if it's murder, if it's violence, probably not. Uh, pretty tough. Thank you so much. All right. For all right, so else? did I razzle dazzle you know for the first no, question? No, but I'm gonna let you one. do it well, anyway. Go ahead. Did you say razzle dazzle? Oh, dazzle? bless you, Tommy C. Bless yeah, he's obvi he's obviously right, black, yeah, right? Yeah, <laughs> All right, razzle dazzle me there, man. All right, second question. For whenever you can't promote yourself, for you can't get someone else bigger to shout you out. How do you get people interested in your personality? I think they just got. They just gotta. You just gotta make a product that they like, and then just, just you just feel connection. You just feel compelled. Most people shout other people out um, because they think they can make money off you. So it's kind of a mutual. It's not always a bad thing either, you know. Um, like I like this yeah. guy. He's good. He's a, but I think he can make money on my level, and then maybe beyond that means I'll make money and I'll get exposure. So or they, or they, it it's kind of a well, that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah. That's that's usually what it is. It could be if they just like your shit. Some some guys like listen. I've had a, you know Tommy. Like mm -hmm. they just say they like your shit. I, I like, like shit. It. I like that. And then that's how me and real talk know. went. Like he had a, he was doing he was still getting paid to do hip hop. I mean he was a pro when I met him, and he was just like I like your show. I was like that's cool. Oh well, that's. And I was like, you're that's black. Fair, Give fair. me credibility. I want to be able to say the N word. <laughs> and get away with it. Like Jake Paul. That's what I told him. I want to be like Jake Paul. I want to drop the N bomb. <laughs> And then, oh no, Lord, no! Then I'm gonna have fucking, you know. Uh, the world always needs more Jake Pauls. Yes, yes. All right, go sleep, boogie. Get out of here. Bye. And have we a good less day. razzle dazzle. Less razzle dazzle. Yeah. <laughs> Real talk. Pick it on the white kids today. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not enough. Let's see. Oh, Danny girl, the pipes, the pipes are calling. What do you want? <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, I was just going to say, it's really good to see Real Talk and Jeff again. Yeah, me too. I, I love Liam, but I'm so happy to see them. I well, miss well, them. We'll, we'll see them on Sundays, every Thank Sunday. Yeah. We appreciate that. It, um, is, it is the crew, the big crew. Also, Tommy, I'm with you about the KSI winning thing. I yeah. can't stand the other guy. I don't know why. I don't even dislike him. I just, I, it's just, he doesn't like jokes, and I don't like him. That's what I mean. You don't like jokes. <laughs> you can't take a joke. If you can't take a joke, I want KSI to knock your teeth out. You know? I don't know. There's something about him I just don't like, and I don't even know what it is. Yeah, I but tell you something, I'm not you terribly all. happy with KSI either, that shit that he pulled with nobody's wife. I'm not, like, this is like, it's kind of like. That's what uh, I said, Tommy, knock, knock each other out, bro. That's what I'm hoping for. Probably Some like clown just, shit to happen. <laughs> <laughs> they, both, they both slip and shit. <laughs> you know, it's not like his brother ever came on my show like he fucking promised a year and a half yeah. ago. I don't know. Maybe you know what, Joe? Go. You held, go. You held on to that forever, too. Not nah, in yeah, publicly. No, no. I'll, I'm gonna be honest with that. I'm gonna be honest with that. September of 2016, I knew he was never coming, and I just I got so many questions about it. Uh, I was pretty sure he wasn't coming. I got so many questions about it that I never, just in case I was wrong, but I never really held on to it. I I DM'd him twice. Yeah, you know, I wasn't gonna fucking chase him down. You know what I mean? I wasn't gonna fuck chase him. him down. You no, know, he said he was coming. He didn't fuck him. Yeah, well, whatever. You know, I do like I did look like Jeff was there. I was totally thrilled when he called. That was a bug out, a total mm -hmm. bug out. It was a lot of fun. It was one of my favorite moments. Can't take that shit away from me. Um, it was a real fun time. But you know, it it does. I am. Am I disappointed? Yes, but I gave up on it over a year ago. Before baited. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, what you got yeah, there, Danny girl? Myself. Are you the gay? Are you the are you the gay girl? I forget. No, I'm no. the one from Texas. Are you? How old are you? I'm 29. Good, good. Good age. Good age. <laughs> do you like? Do you do like? Do you like black guys? <laughs> <laughs> I'd say yes. None of that matters yeah. to me. That doesn't matter. She doesn't like. She just likes men. You like men? How you doing? I like both. You like? Oh, you like both? Would you, would you be, here's a better question, because just because you like both doesn't mean you're a total winner. Would you let both <laughs> join? Jo would, 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 you, would you allow a uh, 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 let's, the three way? Were you, are you all for that? <laughs> Under the right circumstances? Uh, no. I'm, I'm one of those, uh, I'm a one at a time person. All right, you know, <laughs> thanks for calling the show. Have a good day. Bye bye. <laughs>
<laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, uh, I know. Uh, All right, much love, real talking, uh, Jeff. Uh, what about me? What about me? It's my show. Oh yeah, I guess you too, Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sweetheart, you have a good one. Take care. All right, y'all have a great day. Oh, she's got that southern voice too. Y'all have a great day. Tommy loves the. I love Texas girls. Love them. Love them. Love them. What y'all do? And why don't you come over here and drink beer with us? Yes. I like the way you talk. <laughs> Are you from Boston or, or, or New Jersey? I happen to be, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no love for me. Oh, for fuck's sake. Is that, does Dave got a show coming on next? I have no uh, idea. He, uh, he tried to do a 24 hour does. stream and. Nah, he's out. It did, didn't go well. I'm going to yell at my daughter right after this. Well, no, it probably went well. <laughs> hours all right tommy are you thinking about all the groundings he's gonna get in the back of your head i don't know like she's only here for a week but i mean i can't believe she was that crazy like she lost her damn mind uh <laughs> stony draz you're on here hey what's going on man man real quick because i want to get two calls i want to get to you and i want to get the narrator and so what's up uh, man one question one someone. question one well, statement it was, it was from your christmas episode did you ever get to finish in that drummer video what? No, I only watched what you saw. I never bothered. Why? I don't know. It, it just like kind of rubbed me raw because he tried going in like uh, saying that uh, 17 minutes over a tweet, man. <laughs> I know. He was insinuating that you're cheating on your wife. Oh, really? You go to brothels and shit. Yeah, he was saying that you go Did to you see that, Jeff? Uh, they were doing this about Tommy? Who? <laughs> oh, I gotta hear this. Yeah, he, he was insinuating that because uh, he was saying that uh, how you made that joke that you're taking a couple, like fifty dollars out of your uh, wife's uh, wallet, and that uh, you know what fifty dollars get you in the brothel. So he was all trying to twist that and say, "Oh yeah, he he, uh, he likes he just take that as you want." Like, <laughs> so he made so that, that, so what did that have to do with net neutrality? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I was like, this has nothing to do with it. But then the other part that made me really laugh is. Uh, he said that, that anytime you have a bigger YouTuber on, that you yeah. suck their dick and try to get them to do shit with you all the time. Like when you had that. Where did I do that? Mars. I just told you I DM fucking no. Comedy Shorts Gamer twice. That could have changed things but, uh, for me. He, what the fuck? How does he, he know? Played, he played the part in your stream where you kept on trying to talk to Gamer for Mars saying, let's play Fortnite together or some shit like and that. And we never and did. Things. Like, I haven't talked to him since. Exactly. Like, and he's saying, yeah, see how hard he tries to get these other people to do shit. Look, I gotta be honest with you, nothing personal to fucking art, and he's a great guy, and I love his content. Having him on fucking my streams not changing my life, all right? He's a fucking great YouTuber. I love the fact that he's a YouTube historian, but it just shows you how little fucking uh, drummer knows. The only way, like, if Max Mofo came on, fucking, see, he doesn't know anything about the upper levels. Fucking, look, Gamer from Mars, no disrespect. He don't got that kind of clout. To, to, to change things for me. So oh, he's, yeah. he doesn't even know what the fuck he's talking about. If I say I was going to go play, first of all, half it was a goof. Second of all, we live in like uh, two different time zones. So it's it's just utterly ridiculous. I mean, whatever. Who's and I'm cheating on my wife. Oh, it, that was a punk. I, and you know, he's another one, like shadow humor. Thanks for the money, bro. He donated too. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, <it's> goodbye. <laughs> bye bye. I cheated on my wife. <laughs> Who said that? He got that, that all that from a tweet. I, I, I knew it. Really? I knew it. Yeah, you it was like all from a tweet. It was really stupid, really. It was like, uh, 17 just, minutes. 17 basically minutes. makes this whole hit piece on you. That's all it is. Like, I don't give a fuck. Whatever. Why, why do you think I give it the time of day? Yeah. But, uh, you know how the, you look, look, the whole that. video is a picture of me crying, right? And all he does the whole video is cry about me. You know, it's just oh, like yeah, like he defeats his own fucking argument like it, within the first minute of the goddamn thing. That's all I needed to know. I didn't know. All right, oh, well, I don't care. I don't care. That's that's drama I don't need because it doesn't. But he did try to, I, I will say this though. I will say this. I follow up drama I can cash in on, and you ain't it, dude. <laughs> and you've been on YouTuber <laughs> a, YouTube a lot longer than me, so I will leave it at that. All right, Tommy. Do we got to stump a nigga yeah. out? No, no, no. Nah. Talk to you later. I think You're... we didn't see it though, because uh, yeah, I, I thought you would have brought that up because I thought. Uh, it you know like, what? It's, I, I, it's, it's comical. It's I don't know. I'm cheating my wife. Whatever. Jesus, who wants to fuck my old fat ass? You know, goddamn. Everybody's got a price. Yeah. 
I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, I guess it's because with the hookers. Yeah, I guess I could be doing that. Yeah, yeah sure. that's what he was insinuating. Yeah. And like the whole hooker shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. But yeah. also, how the fuck have you not watched Dodgeball? Oh, get the fuck out of yeah, here. I have to call somebody else. Bye bye, bye. Thanks for the call. That's it. I don't care about he's talking about hookers and my wife and shit, but that's. I don't get that. Why? That why are we so? Why are we concerned with Tommy's sex life, bro? Uh, oh, hey, I told him off, so we had to fucking do a hit piece on me. Whatever. Uh, okay. Narrator, you're on the air. What hey, I yeah. So I have no idea what the fuck we're talking about, but I just wanted to say, unlike Danny, I like my men like I like my schools. White only. You don't like. You don't like. Why don't you like black guys? Because <laughs> uh, <laughs> like, I'd rather have a penis, not a garden hose. <laughs> <laughs> Are black guys that much bigger? I thought that was just bullshit. It's just a different shape. It's not. Like, it's fucking weird. It's have a different you, shape? Hey, have you guys ever seen one that's two different colors? No. That shit's I'm not gay. Weird. No. He's no. looking at his dick now. No. He doesn't know what he's fucking talking about. <laughs> you crazy? Uh, well, uh, the state real talks in right now. It, it might look two different colors, too. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Tommy, uh, I heard you uh, try to do that ASMR earlier. That's my shit. Back I did off. not do ASMR. You should do ASMR. You got the voice for it. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, doing, yeah. I'm doing Reddit top posts right now because why not? Yeah, why not? Why not? Exactly. Yeah, you, you, oh. you're the best. So, um... Hey, everybody, subscribe to Tommy C. S. F. T. P. Uh, Keemstar's babies will die if you don't. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I, you, you waited an hour to come in here. No, I didn't. I just, I you just like fucking here a fucking saw hour. you streaming. Look, I'm trying to stay up. I've been up for 36 hours, and I got to get my sleep schedule back on track. Okay. So I saw you were streaming. I, and that's our mom. <laughs> what? Nothing. Jeez. Excuse Nothing. me? It's rice gum. He's calling, so I got to get rid of you. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> See, look what he does. You were, he was right. Oh, shit. All right, everybody. Real talk. I remembered. Plug your shit right now. Yo, you got check this out. I got a new EP coming out, guys, in March. It's called King Slayer Turn King, and we're doing the whole tour. We're going to start in England in May and everywhere else, blah, blah, blah. So you guys be looking out for my new shit, bro. It's going to be sick. It's fucking sick. Hey, you know I mean? uh, Jeff? Yes? All right, fuck you. All right, I'm selling fucking T-shirts. <laughs> what? I'm selling T-shirts. I got stuff below. You can check the latest uh, latest episodes of Brand Breakfast and Beer, our drama new YouTube channel, our drama uh, 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 YouTube channel, uh, which is below called Get to the Point. Everything's in there. And if you, you enjoyed, you went this this far, and you think Keem likes to poop in hotels, then fucking sub it. Oh, one more thing. I'm going to throw somebody a bone. Um, this is what a, a horrible guy I am. Because I guess because drummer 828 isn't around anymore. I'll actually try what to help somebody out. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's fucking, he, he fucking, he's a backstabbing little, you were, you were, I think you were, you were away. Oh, yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a little I, I back. still fuck with her. He's he still talks to me on Twitter and uh, shit. yeah, you should go see the shitty pull with my wife, I, apparently with my wife and shit. What a good guy, huh? What? Yeah, 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 yeah. All because he didn't, oh. like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You go check it out. Watch a video. You learn all the thing you have to know. Another Kenny. Another Kenny. Yeah. All right. I'm, I'm putting this in there. I'm going to retweet this again. This guy, uh, if you guys are interested, I'm not going to like go on. Uh, I thought the video was pretty good. Uh, he's got a theory on, on, on Keem building an army and stuff like that. Um, obviously, I think there's, there's some truth to it. Um, but if you, this is just regular old YouTube commentary, you go check it out. Uh, my man's name is James Crow. I thought it was a pretty good video. If you got some time, go check it out. I just put it in the description box below. Um, yeah, I'll put it in the regular description box as well. All right, let's, let, let me do this. I'm feeling like a I'm feeling like a good person. Uh, so when people actually watch this not live, they'll be able to see it. I'll just throw it in there. Um, yeah, it's just you have his theories in the, on the commentary community. It's it's reasonably neutral. Um, uh, he obviously, but he's not like a total fucking Tommy C suck off. All right, um, just to be honest with you. So I'm putting it in the description box below, and uh, that's it. That's all I got. Uh, all my craps below. Um, yeah. Buy stuff. Buy stuff. Like, sub, and share. Slap a like on it right now. I'll see you tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. This is real talk if you didn't know. It's on right now. This is the almighty infinite. Independent excellence. Devil fighting rebel titan. We smoking alchemists. Fake identities. Okay, you cool with Jason Bourne. Running with these Wolverines. Okay, you about to kill.
cats are stolen. I, I ain't never been a liar, got tired of niggas playing me. Head in my legs like she bout to catch a pedigree. Shy town the king's home, slapping fives, black stones. Six mile to danger zones, bullets look like waffle cones. So affiliated to evolution of Machiavelli. Don't, don't make me read the Migos to you like I'm Chip Kelly. Uh. They feel my struggle, I express it through my, my hip hop. I'm about to make it hard to breathe. Here's a head look.